Which body got a deuce? What? Hello guys, welcome to TAC. So today in this video, I am going to show you how to root your Lenovo K3 node. Before doing that, note that if anything happens, if your device may break or not, it will not be my responsibility. So do this at your own risk. Do this method at your own risk. And this method is 100% working. So I think that you don't have to worry about anything as like it may break your phone but if it may break it will not be my responsibility do this at your own risk so let's get to it so root, for rooting your Lenovo you know, K3 node you will be needing some files the first one is SP flash tool second one is Torb recovery third one is the boot.img and fourth one is the super su file so first of all all you have to do is put this boot.img and the super sc file in your uh, Lenovo K3 node so here I have stored both of the files in storage external storage in root folder boot img and super sc so first of all you will need to open sp flash tool open this flash underscore tool dot exe I have already opened that and download this k3 node perf recovery i will be providing the links for to download all of these files so download the files from that link after downloading this perf recovery extract it to one folder you will be getting these two files recovery.image and android scatter file so all you have to do is go on here press the scatter loading option and locate the uh, to our recovery folder in which there is the android scatter file and open it it will load the android scatter file make sure download only is selected and make sure that DADL all with checksum is selected so right now you have to power off your device let it shut down after it shuts down, uh, press this download button in the SP Flash tool and connect your device, connect your device with the data cable and the SP Flash tool will start the process once it detects the phone. Okay. The process has started. And it has finished the process after fin after the process is finished you will get this uh, download okay with the green tick now you can close it now you can close the uh, sp flash tool so after doing that all you have to do is boot into recovery mode so for that you have to press all the three buttons power button plus volume up and down button press them until you see the Lenovo logo and release the power button and keep holding the volume button you will see team win project this step is most important if you will not boot into recovery mode then you will lose your top recovery and you have to flash it again so make sure that you uh, boot into recovery mode after installing top recovery by sp flash tool so now you have to install the boot.img in order to patch your bootloader in order to root the, your device so go to install select install image and locate your boot.img file so i have to find the boot.img file and it is located in my external storage in root folder so i have to in i have to press first this install image then I have to select select storage then in micro I have I have to select this micro SD card ok so here it is the boot.img file just click on it select the boot partition and swipe to confirm flash it will start process it will start the process image flash has completed now click on back again back and here click install zip click on supersu.zip 
and swipe to confirm flash it will start the process and it will it will finish soon yeah it completed the process so now all you have to do is just click on reboot system uh, it may happen that your device take a lot of time to boot but it's just normal because after uh, this process i think that's it may some it take it may take some time so after the routing process is done you will see the superso file superso application here just click on that and you will be getting this kind of app open so that's it guys your Lenovo K3 Nord is rooted if you want to verify or if you want to check whether this uh, method has worked or not uh, download root checker app from play store it will show you that your device is properly rooted or not so that's it guys i hope that this method helps you for routing purpose after routing you can download many custom roms many themes you can do anything with your device you can customize it the way you like so thank you guys for watching my video don't forget to give me a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe my channel if you haven't subscribed yet and if you have any suggestions if you have any questions and queries you can put them in comment section below i will try to reach as soon as possible thank you guys